The Russian MP was forced to miss a UN General Assembly meeting earlier this month after finding his visa had been annulled. Konstantin Kosachev, who oversees foreign affairs in the upper house of the Russian parliament, was added to the US sanctions list back in April. Two weeks later, his visa, which allowed him to take part in meetings at the UN's New York headquarters, was cancelled. It meant that he had to sit out a discussion of a resolution that he'd actually co-authored. The recent US sanctions against Russia targeted more than a dozen top government officials and seven of the country's richest men. Now, the sanctions were linked to the Ukraine crisis and Moscow's alleged attempts to interfere in the 2016 US presidential race. Konstantin Kosachev says that Washington never explained why he was targeted. I was added to the sanctions list with no explanation. The only reason given on the U.S. Treasury Department's website is that I'm an official of the Russian government. It didn't affect any of my personal interests as I don't have bank accounts or assets in the U.S. It's made it impossible for me to continue my attempts to bridge the gap between our parliaments. Then I also had my visa annulled, which had allowed me to take part in the U.N. meetings in the U.S. A week ago, I was supposed to attend a General Assembly meeting on a resolution that I co-authored. Unfortunately, I wasn't allowed to take part. The same now applies to other international organizations. It's a blatant violation by the US as the host of an international organization's HQ. It goes against international law and rules of diplomacy. I'm assured that I was targeted for my beliefs and political activity, which has nothing to do with the United States.